Liberty and Century met in Eldersburg on February 11th in a Carroll County Athletic League boys basketball showdown, the second meeting of the season for the Crosstown rivals. The Knights, winners of seven games in a row, prevailed in the first game at home by a score of 63 to 57. And they start strong on this night. Here's John Padlet with a steal that leads to a fast break layup. Century leads 11 to seven just past the midway point of the first quarter. The Knights lead by 10 points during the second quarter, but the Lions fight back. Shane Stewart drains a three-pointer with 5.39 left in the frame to make it 26 to 21 and he's on his way to 18 first half points. Century leads 36-27 with 1.15 to play after Nick Prokic scores from close range, but Liberty closes out the quarter. Elias Rommel knocks down a three with 57 seconds left and it's 36 to 30. And Stewart beats the buzzer on this drive to the hoop and shot off the glass. Century leads 36-32 at halftime. The Knights heat up from behind the arc in the third quarter, and Andrew Marcinko sinks two three-pointers in the period. His second one comes with 2.43 to go, and Century leads 48-43. Marcinko scores seven points in the third quarter. The junior opens the fourth quarter with another tray, and the Knights are up 53-45. The visiting team takes a 58-48 lead when Marcinko finds Jake Winkles on a layup and Century is closing in on the Carroll County title. Stewart and the Lions won't go away though. This layup with 2.49 to go cuts the deficit to 64-61. But Century is in the bonus and starts sinking free throws to widen the gap. Plus, a layup from Josh Hulamibe after a long pass down court with 58 seconds remaining gives the Knights a 67-61 lead. Final score, Century 70, Liberty 63. The Knights claim their fourth straight county championship behind 22 points from Marcinko, 15 from Pavlik, and 11 from Ahulamide. Pavlik adds 10 rebounds, and Winkles has seven to go along with four assists. Century improves to 17-2, 10-1 in the county. Stewart finishes with 34 points, and Tyler Downs adds 10 for the Lions, who fall to 12-8, 6-5. Want more local sports coverage? Be sure to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok.